All right, class, it's Mr. O, the hip hop teacher, checking in from outer space. Well, almost. Today, we're taking a trip through our solar system, and yes, Pluto is invited. Don't worry, Pluto, I got you. Let's start where we live. Mercury is the planet closest to the sun. Mercury is small, fast, and hot. Then cold, like extremely hot and extremely cold. A year on Mercury is super short, only 88 Earth days. That means Mercury finishes school before you finish summer break. Venus is next, and Venus is the hottest planet, even hotter than Mercury. Why? Because Venus has thick clouds that trap heat like a giant blanket. Venus also spins backwards, so the sun rises in the west. Venus said, I'm doing things my way. Earth, that's us. Earth has air to breathe, water to drink, and snacks to eat. So far, Earth is the only planet we know with life. Please treat it nicely. Earth is our home, not a rental. Mars is the red planet. Mars has dust storms, giant volcanoes, and signs that water used to be there. Scientists are very curious about Mars because one day humans might visit or even live there. Mars is basically Earth's neighbor that we keep side-eyeing. Now we enter the gas giants. No solid ground, no landing, no bouncing. Jupiter is the biggest planet in the solar system. It's so big that all the other planets could fit inside it. Jupiter has a giant storm called the Great Red Spot that's been spinning for over 300 years. That storm is older than your great-great-great-grandparents. Saturn is the planet with the famous rings. Those rings are made of ice, rock, and dust. Saturn is so light that if you could find a bathtub big enough, it would float. I don't recommend testing that. Uranus is tilted on its side like it fell over and stayed that way. It spins sideways and has freezing temperatures. Uranus is cold, windy, and quiet. Basically, space said, turn the volume down. Neptune is the farthest major planet from the sun. Neptune has the strongest winds in the solar system, blowing faster than a race car. If space had weather alerts, Neptune would be on the news every day. And now, Pluto. Pluto used to be called the ninth planet, and now it's called a dwarf planet. That doesn't mean Pluto isn't important, it just means it's smaller and hangs out in the Kuiper Belt far, far away. Pluto is cold, icy, and still part of our solar system family. Once family, always family. So remember class, the solar system is big, the universe is bigger, and you are standing on a planet spinning through space, learning science. That's powerful. This is Mr. O, the hip-hop teacher, reminding you, the universe is your home.